Hey everyone, Technomancer here with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to freeze your iPad screen on a specific app. So let's get started. So in order to freeze your app or put it lock on a specific app, first thing we need to do is go into our setting of our iPad. From there on, we're just going to go to accessibility, scroll down until you see guided access. I'm going to click on that and go ahead and turn that on. Now this is how it's going to work. So the guided access allows us to basically keep the iPad on a single app and in order to activate it we'll turn on accessibility shortcuts so that when we triple click on that top button it will ask us to activate that guided access. Now you might also want to consider putting a passcode if you don't want someone to uh, get out of that without the, knowing your password. So in order to do that you can use the touch ID of the iPad or you can just uh, create a passcode. So here for example this is just a Example one, of course, make sure it's more complicated than this and complex. So now we have done that. We set up a passcode. Now we can go to an app that we'd like to lock the screen on. So let's go ahead and pick an app here. So I'm going to go ahead and pick one app. Maybe let's say tips, for example. Maybe I just want them to be locked on the tips app. In order to freeze it now, I triple click on that top button here. So I'm going to do one, two, three and it's going to ask if I want to start the guided access. So I'll click on start and as you can see here you know, now we have started the guided access so now I swipe up or try to pull down the control menu or try to exit out of this. I can't. I'm stuck or frozen uh, on this hype on this app so that's how I'm fro basically on this app and unable to move around or do anything. So it's kind of frozen on this single app. So that's how you do it. And now to exit out, you want to triple click on the top touch ID or the lock button quickly three times. One, two, three. And it's going to ask for that passcode that we set up. And I can click on end. And it has ended and I can get out of the iPad just like that. So that's how you freeze your iPad to a single app on your iPhone. I hope iPad. I hope this video is helpful. If so please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPad and other iOS devices. See you guys next time.